Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your host, Anon Jr., and it is not your imagination. That big glass box behind me has grown. Uh, I just not as much as I really needed it to. Uh, so that is going to be the primary project for today. I want to to get that up to the point where I can set the fence gates down at Y39. So the water will stop at Y40. And I instead of dispensers, I think I'm going to try waterlogged trapdoors. Because I was having some weird issues with the water in the last go-round anyway. Uh, so what I'll do is... Crikey, how many melons? Sorry. I got distracted by uh, the uh, the very productive melon farm. You know good problems and all that. No, no, I want the hopper behind there. There we go. Because now I'm curious. I didn't AFK that long either and I got a stack in 20 dirt. And uh, yeah, pumpkins aren't quite as productive. Although still, that's almost two stacks of dirt right there. Alright, while well, we're checking stuff, let's uh... Let's get some emeralds, because I need some cyan glass. These two blocks are the last I have on my inventory. And we'll get that set up. Because if you remember when I when I did the failed attempt earlier, in addition to producing nothing but cod, uh, I got... I got... Um, a short-term memory thing. No. Uh, I... <laughs> I had some weird water source issues that I think can be solved by using waterlogged trapdoors instead of dispensers. That is my hope. That that is that is what I would like to see happen. You know, hopefully we shall see. Uh, I would also like these guys to to give me a few more trading sessions than they normally do, but ain't nothing I can do about that. Hmm. Come on, slackers. He's traded with me three times. Come on. I got iron. Alright, that's about what I'd normally get. Maybe, maybe I already traded with Thorn there twice. You want to go for three? Maybe I didn't trade with him three times and I, I got... Fine. Fine, fine, fine. I'll take what I got and go. Anyway, so... <clears throat> yeah, if you remember last time we had... Oh, sand. Then we'll get to the trading. If you remember last time we had a weird issue with... Uh, the water source is not getting dispensed and picked up properly with the redstone grid that we were using. So, I'm going. I probably should math out how to manage the redstone in such a way. That's not a bad deal. Yeah, well, all right. Well, I say that now. It looks nice until, yeah, 11. 11 sandstone. Uh, <clears throat> of course, now I'm mad that I, I just made a stack and a half of dispensers and <laughs> I don't need them for this project. <laughs> oh, hey, another objective complete. No, I don't want chiseled. I want the regular sandstone. There we go. So I got all my chiseled that I need. I got all the red that I need. I got all, all the stairs that I need and the smooth that I need. I just finished off my slabs. Now I just need eight more stacks of sandstone. No big. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, let's put those away. How are you going to get eight more stacks of sandstone? <laughs> uh, as soon as I'm done 
playing around with the guardian farm, uh, <laughs> I'm, oh, that's right, you don't. Uh, I'm going to uh, double the size of the cactus farm. Ah. Uh. And hope that I can get enough to uh, to make that worthwhile. What do you mean again? I, I haven't doubled it yet. I've been talking about it a while. I just haven't actually, you know, gotten to the part where I do the doubling of the Guardian Farm. Also, guess what's live now? Yep, 1.18 is out. Uh, <laughs> there have already been a few issues found. Uh, hopefully, by the time we get to running Season 3, though... <gasps> is he actually here, or is he on somebody else's island? Oh, I just traded away all my emeralds. Oh, no, I got a couple. There we go. Uh, that's good. Don't... A wandering trader. A wandering trader. This is the one time I'm actually happy to see you. Come out, come out wherever you are. He's in the middle of my guardian farm, isn't he? Hello? The, the, the announcement said that you were here. Are, are you not here? He's on my island. Is he really? I don't know. We're about to find out. I mean, honestly, that would be that would be par for the course. Are are you hiding in the mushrooms? No. Maybe he's not. Okay. Nope. Oh wait, what about up on the roof? Yes. Are you in the field of dreams? Which I honestly wouldn't think they would be. I, I don't think they spawn in the middle of crops, do they? I don't know. I mean, with my luck, he probably just walked off a ledge into the void anyway. All I'm going to find is a sad llama sitting, sitting around. Um... Let's see if he's up on the on the top part. I see a rest. Yeah, I'm looking for him. He just passed him. Where? He's over by the fountain. Oh. I'd like to know him. where his sheep is. <laughs> I was about to say, what was that? Uh, that would be the voice pack that I put in there. Well, shoot, you're not giving me any of the stuff that I want. I... Mm, mm. Where's my stack of sand? Or bamboo? I got jungle saplings. I got yellow dye. I... Uh, I got a guy that gives me a better deal on glowstone, too. Where's your llamas, anyway? Where is this llama? I don't know. Are we about to Maybe have some llama drama? Those things? But uh, there's no spawnable space on top of that. That's part of why the design is the way it is. How Maybe they thought they could and found out not so much. I mean... Should, should I check down there for a little little bit of leather and a sad lead? Is it? Hello? Oh, llama. Why do you need them? Because I only have one llama, and he's lonely. Ah. 
Why are you asking about need? I isn't that usually not the question you're asking? Mm, just curious. Curious minds want to know. Mm-hmm. Sure. I am curious. Uh-huh. Okay. Fine. Let me get off of this part of the island before I find out that uh, I forgot to sleep and phantoms are coming. Oh, don't throw the axe. I can't believe that. I finally got a wandering trader to spawn up here. And what did he have? Nothing. You can't believe that? I don't want to believe that. Ah, that's a different story. Okay. Alright. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Thanks, Arcadius. Appreciate that. Let's let that go, and I was in the middle of something. Oh, uh, <laughs> I know, I just want some scaffolding. Like, this is sad. Th this is not, this is just not right. A freaking spiral staircase of slime is not the way this is supposed to work. <laughs> it's scaffolding of a sort. Oh yeah, it's, it's scaffolding. <laughs> Don't look down. Don't fall. <laughs> Careful when you jump. Oh, and mind the void over on that side of it. <laughs> mind the gap? Yeah. I, I also keep expecting, half expecting to come in here. And, uh... Oh, yeah, I know. I'm surprised none of us have found any bamboo. How would we just find bamboo? Uh, a, I'm still a little surprised that none of the challenges provide it. And B, a uh, wandering trader would provide it. And since both Medic and Arcadius uh, have more spawnable surface for wandering traders, I would have expected them to have managed one by now. Ah. ah! Did you fall? Maybe. Just a little? <sighs> it looked painful. It was not painful. It was just painfully embarrassing. I do not need the wrench because I'm not doing the dispensers. I'll hang on to the lever and the redstone and the dust and the block and the terracotta and the wool. I, I guess technically I don't need all these buckets now too if I'm going to do it the way I think it's going to work. Which means it probably won't work that way anyway, so... We'll see. Oh, that is how life happens. Some days. Uh, yeah. Some days indeed. Like, uh... Yeah. Uh, just some of the repairs I've been working on lately have been... Sp special? special. Yep. Yep, very, very special. Uh, 
So I'm at 28. And Arcadius, you said it was between 40 and 60 that they spawn? Waiting for the lag. He has an Asian build in no bamboo. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure out where I'm putting the trapdoors and fence gates. Uh, I'm not looking for give or take. Do, do you not see all these precision engineered? Okay, no, never mind. I, I withdraw the question. You know what I really wish for? Elytra. Fish. No, I, I had plenty of fish. Not the fish I wanted, but plenty of fish. Maybe I should make a fish data pack so all the records play fish tunes. No. Or you weren't talking nobody about that fish. That. No? Literally nobody wants that. <laughs> you don't want a bunch of jam band albums in Minecraft? No, thank you. No? No, thank you. Maybe some Barry Manilow. Mm. What, what what can I find that's worse? I mean, we could always do Grateful Dead. That, but that. Uh, no, thank you. Do nothing but Nickelback. Yeah, but I want music. I noticed you didn't comment on that one. <laughs> nope. People to be ready to trade again. I'll at least start filling in some more of this. I wonder how much lawn I can get installed before uh, the end of the season. Because again, we are ending the season at the end of the calendar year. We should be starting season three at the top of the new year and I've got my request in for a transfer to Nodecraft. I have not heard back from them yet, but I also think there's a, I, I gotta finish one more thing before I will hear back from them. I, I just need to, I meant to do it yesterday. Actually, I meant to do it Wednesday, but, but the tired was real. I'd say there was tacos, but there wasn't tacos. There was ravioli and a nap. Tacos. Literally. <laughs> I don't know that I slept enough to call it a nap. Yeah, I guess this doesn't cover up where the uh, snowman would have been. Huh. Interesting. Hi, guys. I still gotta get the, uh... The, the... Mule? Or donkey? Which are, which are you? Uh, I need mule. Eight K. 
cow, eight pig, sixteen chicken, and a sheep. One sheep of each color. Is that one what that means? One sheep of each color. So that's actually sixteen sheep. Yep. Okay. That is actually sixteen sheep. So I do need to multiply my sheep's. Mm-hmm. I, I thought you'd already managed that part. No, I thought there was one that I only needed eight sheep for. No. You need one sheep, two sheep, red sheep, blue sheep. I should make it easier to count them all. This one's in a little car. I can retexture this one with a star. No, I think I got that backwards. It's been a little while. I kind of wish Pink Geek was on so that way I could pick on her because I read her enough, <laughs> enough Dr. Yeah. Seuss to, to actually speak in rhyme for a while after. Although, to be fair, that was just, you know, the, the returning of, of favors in life and such. Orange. I need a yellow. If I fall in that pit and die, I've got a minecart already ready to, you know, clean up the mess. <laughs> How do I make the flower thing work? I just put them down and then multiply them? Uh, just hit it with bone meal. Okay. You talking about the two high flowers? Yeah. Feet are at thirty nine. Okay, so that. Oh, let's not do. Okay. That should be there. It's going to be one more to that side. So how far away from your sheep herd are you? And do you have all the colors you need? Uh, not quite. 
but yeah, I gotta make up a couple more. Which color are you missing? That one. Uh, yellow. Uh, and... you should have a sunflower, which will give you yellow. Nope, and that's... I just put it down. Oh, okay. I can get you one of every die if you need it. I think I've got most of them made. Come on. Where's that XP? That's right. You guys keep bankers hours. Keep reaching for the coffee I haven't poured yet. Oh, well. Look, I mean... You guys clearly have nothing else going on today, so uh, what, what do you say you open up shop early? Did that ever work when uh, we worked retail? Nope. Okay. Didn't stop anybody from trying, though. You aren't lying. give the XP a better way to actually exit the farm. <laughs> oh, you do have one more trade. Why, yes, I will happily do that. Anybody else? One more? One more? Una mas? No? Okay, fine. Uh, all right. I'll let you guys be for more for now. I'll turn the iron farm back on when we get to a little bit lower. What you missing? Uh, I was trying to dye my sheep's, and one of them came out the wrong color. Oh. And I don't know what color. I just overrode, and I have sheep running around everywhere. <laughs> And weren't you one of the ones making fun of my uh, my little sheep farm with everybody in his place? In their stalls? Mm-hmm. In their happy place. Okay. They where where happy. they got plenty of food. There's no danger. Their happy place. Can you put eggs in the thing to make, um... Chickens? No, to make bone meal? No. You, you cannot well, comp... You cannot compost eggs. Yes, you can. Uh... I mean... I, I'm sure if you want to get technical, you can compost any biological material, but I'm... Um, no, the game will not let you compost oh. eggs. It is a thing. I mean, honestly, uh, I, I wouldn't mind if they would add the ability to compost the uh, the fish. Also a thing that should be compostable. Mm hmm Didn't make all that cod well, just that little more useful. Right, I needed... Oh, I needed a little bit of cobble.
What do you need? Uh, you need bone meal for something, or? I was just trying to figure out what to do with but the bazillion eggs every time I walk by oh. my chicken farm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, throw them into the void for the the. I don't know of it. That's not precarious. Whose bright idea was this? Oh, yeah. Glad you said it. Mm hmm. I've still been thinking about that uh, bit from Phil McKnight's podcast where somebody asked. You know, I, I want to rewire the pots, the potentiometers, usually just abbreviated pots. I wanted I, that he wanted to replace the pots in his uh, left-handed telly. And he was trying to figure out if he needed left-handed pots. Which is honestly a question I never really considered. Feels like, no, no, you don't need left-handed pots. You, you just need to wire it backwards. Which... Also, I never really thought about. But, and I'm kind of wondering about how many left-handed questions he's been getting lately because one of his more recent videos, that one about how to tell if you need a left-handed guitar or not. Which... I know is one of those things that uh, guitarists will argue about until the heat death of the universe. Fair. Like, the sun and the moon will come crashing down and still there will be two guitarists arguing about whether or not you actually need a left-handed guitar. I just want guitar. you to know mm -hmm. that that was your mic that picked up my sneeze. Oh. I turned mine off. <laughs> um, <laughs> you're not coming down with anything, are you? Uh, nothing other than the usual for our state, which is it's 40 degrees different in the morning Between to the, the morning afternoon and, the and then back yeah. again to the evening. Yeah, that, that does not help anybody. So I'm coming down with local weather. I mean, I try to catch the local weather, but, you know, the newscast is always a little... Oh, that's not what you're referring to. No, I referred to being literally sick of the weather. Fence gates away. See, this is the part that you don't see in all those build videos where they go, oh yeah, and you just put a bunch of fence gates and it's like... Of course, I, I, I look at this and I think of that, that Guardian farm that Cub Fan did, uh, what was it, two seasons ago? It was back when back when the, 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 the big ocean change, when Tango made that iron farm out of uh, Drown. Um, and he did this 
massively overproductive guardian farm. But it, it used the soul sand blocks to push the guardians up into a bunch of water streams suspended by fence gates. <laughs> Except he covered the entire chunk that the uh, guardi that the temple was in. Uh, I want to say he was pretty close to the record for deaths that season too, and that somehow Scar managed to surpass him. That's impressive. Have you s you've seen a Scar video? That that is that. I have. Oh wait, no, that you said that's no, impressive, just... not surprising. Yeah. Yeah. I can't tell if it's magenta, pink, or purple. Uh that I'm missing. Use the F three menu to tell you figure out which one you're looking at and uh Work at it from there. Does it say the name of what I'm looking at? In the lower right hand corner. Minecraft empty. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, gosh, but they keep moving. Mm hmm. That's what sheep do. Waterlogged. It's not letting me look at the sheepies. I mean, you could also shear them and see what wool comes off. Oh! That was what I was going to do. Oh! Hi! What are you doing there? Oh, that one little block of... Okay. Uh... I think I got them all now. Think so? We're about to find out. Oh. Nope. I just teleported myself to my island. <laughs> Yay! Nice. What'd I get? You got the animal farm challenge. You got the joy of completing and something. I got a horse egg. Nice. I'm trying to remember if there was a challenge that required having horses, or... Boom, my pig sack. Did you just ask where your pigs were at? About to move my pigs back. Oh. Right now, they're all tied up in the middle. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right, because you, you wanted to build. They were too far away where you wanted them. Mm-hmm. <sighs> all right. So far, so good. Hello, Beach Duck. How you doing? Are you doing okay? Wait a second. Or you lagged it. I I know. I know. <laughs> Uh, we still get to get Beach Duck set up with Among Us so we can do a special stream at some point with the extended Coffee Craft family playing Among Us. That's going to be so fun when we finally get to it. Oh, yeah.
I do need... Uh, I just realized I forgot to uh, get the updated intermission video put together and set up. Have you been able to play around with the video at all? Uh, it, it's in my inbox folder. Okay. <laughs> where, where I, start? It's where I, it's where I keep forgetting about it. Something, something, something absent-minded. I forget what it's called. Come on, guys. One more trade. Come on. You know you want to. Ah. What do I do with all these animals? Ah. Again? Well, you milk the cows. You shear the sheep. Not the other way around. Uh, I kind of wish the pigs did more than just give you ham, you know, when you butcher them. Or, sorry, I mean, pork chops. But, ooh, but if we wanted mud in a game, you could put a pig on dirt and it make mud. Mm-hmm. Uh, they did that in the short-lived, uh, we're trying to beat out Pokemon Go version of Minecraft. Ah. Wait. I take it it didn't go well. Uh, it just... They tried really hard. What's that ouch for? The the short lived <laughs> you wish it was po Pokemon Go? <laughs> I mean that that is the way it ended up being. Uh you know. It really was. They they were trying to capitalize on what was happening. I can't blame them one bit. Uh it just it just didn't work out. I don't know. Certain people played it pretty obsessively. The Minecraft one? Yeah. Uh, well, I know Green and Mumbo did a bunch of videos from that. What are you talking about? Hideous did. No, I didn't think he played the Minecraft one, though. I thought he just did Pokemon Go. Oh, no. He totally played the Minecraft one. Oh, okay. Because it's Pokemon. Okay. And at the end of the day... What else could you get the... Oh, you know what you could use the pigs for? Finding mushrooms. Put a pig on a leash and, and, uh, and get, it to, get it to help you find mushrooms in the game. Oh, nope. No? Why not? No, sorry. I can't figure out how to unleash my pigs. Oh, uh, right-click on them again? I tried to right-click on them again and... It, it hit him. Then you didn't right click. Oh, well, something clicked. <laughs> there we go. <sighs> Whose bright idea was it to make this thing out of glass? Although, to be fair, I did want to be able to see into it. Maybe not the falling part in the middle, but that wouldn't have looked right. I, I definitely wanted to see the bottom and see the spawning area. I'm not about to replace the middle after all this work. Although, depending on, uh, <laughs> depending on how many trips to get cyan glass for the river, I might revise that opinion a smidge. Is that what you're using, Cyan? Yeah. It's a lot of green and blue. How are mm -hmm. you getting the blue for that? I'm trading with the Cleric Villager for Lapis. Ah. And I got the Cactus Farm for the green. It's not easy getting green. Awful. <laughs> But you do what I was doing.
<sighs> Alright, well, maybe one more one more day night cycle and I'll be able to manage this. thinking I might want to go ahead and put away all those water buckets, but then I realized that if the water doesn't spread the way I think I can get it to, it's going to be a lot of unhappiness all around. Stack and a half dispensers. That was a pain to craft. As you well know, Rayest. Because, uh, wasn't it you that crafted all those, uh, dispensers for the, uh, um, storage room project on, uh, last season? Yes, I did. Thank you for remembering that contribution. Mm-hmm. As the one trying desperately to figure out, okay, this one goes left. Is, is that facing left? No, I don't think. Yes, no, maybe. Hi, guys. Alright. Yay! 101 levels. Try to get two rounds out of them in the Minecraft morning. I feel the need to specify that for some reason. I might go grab some cobble stairs and tear out these slabs and put the stairs in just, just to have it connected for no good reason. Although it's not like I'm worried about running out of cobble. Although I noticed that my uh, my farm there... Oh, oh that's... Oh, don't throw it. I keep forgetting to build the blast chamber. So I can get the cobble farm automated. And then get a basalt farm working into that. Time, time, time. Too it's many. a good answer to a riddle. Hmm? Time, it's a good answer to a riddle. Yeah. But only if there's a ring involved. Okay, Minecraft water. I, somehow I need to get enough snow to make another snowman. Do you want to build a snowman? Oh no, not I do right have... right now. Huh? I said I not have, right now, but thank you. I do have two more snow blocks. I could make one more snowman. Except I need to I need to make sure that I cover them up so that way the rain doesn't get them and I need to chain I need to actually put them in the right location because some genius forgot that uh, snowmen don't produce snow layers below Y equals 124 in mushroom biomes. Ouch. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I wonder what it would be in a... I need to check and see what it would be in a deep ocean, because maybe I can put the snow farm on top of the guardian farm. And have it just that little bit lower. Hi, guys. Come on. You gonna make me wait the whole hour? You gonna make me wait the whole hour. Alright, well, 
these guys are figuring out their life. I will go pour some coffee. Because I can find where I hid the intermission button. Ooh, yes, Beach like Duck. Some idea. people do have pigs as pets. I, I don't know. I don't know who you were thinking of. <laughs> Okay. You know, I just realized that I've had the cover on the camera this whole time. Hi. <laughs> it's been that kind of week. This whole week, it's just been that kind of week. And I... Uh, How are you doing? <laughs> I'm surprised I got everything logged in and that's all you guys got. That's all you guys got. Okay. figure out why there was a green light next to the uh, chat settings. I, I think there was a new feature added at some point and which new feature and why is impenetrable from where I was looking. Thank you Twitch. I appreciate that. 
sort of, mostly, ish. All right, let me go get some more green dye cooking. That way I'll have enough for... Oh. Wait, okay, no. Oh. Mic is working. For a second there, I thought it wasn't. Because that's just been my week. Alright, let's get that cooking. Let's get some blue dye. Some glass. Round two of the blue. Hi right, guys. And last one, right? Last one. Let's just go ahead and get placeholders all around. Alright, onward and forward up to Y equals 40 on our rickety slime block platform. If, uh, if time wasn't an issue, I'd probably be considering uh, if I could get a slime block launcher built that would take me up to the top of this thing faster. Right. Or maybe just a, uh, a little slime block flying machine. That is one of the things that I've not gotten into that I really do want to, is trying to build flying machines and moving contraptions. I, I am not reliably told that it is, that it is not that hard. I don't trust, I don't trust the source of that information, but, uh, they claim it's not that hard. All right. So the bottom of the water will be at 40. And we'll get the trapdoors to 60 and we'll put the prismarine above it. And hopefully this time, we'll get some Guardians. Not of the galaxy. Those guys are too much trouble. I, I think I think several of them have uh, seen a significant rise in their asking price these days <laughs> for various movies. go ahead and get the corners up to Y60 so that way while I'm waiting for the traders to reset and allow me to get more glass I can uh, start work on the upper part of the platform too with the waterlog trap doors and that sort of thing but I might get close enough And I don't want to make it that hard to move around said corners either. I 
I'm afraid to look at how many uh, blocks of cyan glass I've crafted. That is a number that scares me. And I do need to make sure that I do some slightly more frequent backups and get a local copy. Matter of fact, uh, after, after the live stream, I will probably go ahead and do that. Because we're, we're at, we are on not just me. I, I heard a zombie, didn't I? Yeah. Where? How? There's nothing but carton there. Oh. How did you get on the block? What in the world? Okay. Sure. Fine. guys too. So glad I did that. No, 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 no. I didn't want all that carpet. Come on now. Make sure I'm throwing what I want to throw. Okay, there we go. Let's go try to grab another round of iron trading. Also missed the opportunity to name one of those guys Iron Man. Although, what would the other two be? Because uh, there was... I mean, I don't think I'm naming one of them Rhodey. Hi, guys. I thought I could get in one more... Uh, pre-morning trade trade no nothing don't mind me I'm just waiting until you open semi-patiently waiting no I'm not I'm not patiently waiting for anything Work it. You, you're not slowing down on me, are you? Uh, guys, we only got one round of trading in. I've been meaning to talk to you about your performance. If 
you guys could kindly reset, that would be greatly appreciated. Come on. One more round. No? <sighs> well, look, if you guys aren't going to trade proper, then uh, at least get to producing iron. I think we are at that point where I've done too much trading with them in too short a time. Because that is a thing that can happen, and it can, you know. Consult your admin if. No. Actually, I think I had enough cyan that that was probably a bad move. Yeah. Sorry. Right. That blue's not going to go to waste. I'll keep that. Oh. oh. Next one up. I'll keep that handy for the river. Let's at least work with what we can. through all that stone. Not yet. I'm not there yet. G -g give me just getting a little bit closer to the end of that project, and I might be there, but not yet. Especially since uh, I worked really hard to get that stone supply top back off after loaning a bunch to... Well, not loaning, giving. Loan would imply that I wanted it back. Somebody was looking for a bunch of chiseled stone. Let's not jump over into the void, shall we? You know, I just realized I have a whole bunch of ladders. Why am I not just building a giant ladder up one side? That that would actually be like, I don't know, a smart thing. That's what I'm going to do after this. I'll do this. I'll tear down that, that slime block monstrosity and put, a, uh, put an actual like ladder up. Glad I thought of that. This laid into it. Am I even going to be able to complete one circuit around? precariously take this down. I'll go grab ladders because I can't do much more until I can get some emeralds and I don't have a good means of mass emerald production beyond those three yahoos who are getting tired of trading with me. Which really is one of the things I probably should have considered when setting up my little village. But on the other hand, I don't I don't know if I could do it again that I would make any 
different choices. Because uh, no matter what I did, the, the mass trading was always going to be of a limited supply or the utility was going to be of limited supply. Like, I could... I could have done no masons and three more of those guys, but the masons actually sell stuff that I can't easily get, like quartz. Uh, matter of fact, it's because of those masons that I was able to finish the quartz challenge as fast as I was. Uh, I mean, I probably could have grabbed a flock of shepherds for and traded wool. Or maybe some of the bow makers for uh, for string, but I, I I say when you stare into the void, you got to be careful that it doesn't stare back. Or is that just your cat? So yeah, I mean, uh, I tried the cartographer thing, and that didn't work out as well as I thought. But I also didn't take the time to do the zombified thing to get them down as low as possible, and that might have been a big part of it too. Uh, I think with, se with Season 3, since we'll be back on vanilla and there won't be a cap on villagers... I might try to get a, a segment set up that is for nothing but mass trading. Yeah, so, something that has tons of those guys for getting stuff out of the iron farm. And just put them by the iron farm. You know, get, uh, get a... What's the collective noun for a bunch of shepherds? Is it a flock of shepherds? I feel like it should be a flock of shepherds. Anyway, get get a bunch, get a herd of shepherds. Oh, I don't have as many ladders as I thought I did. Huh. Where did all my ladders go? Oh, well. Because, of course. And since the ladders are not permanent... Oh, come on. Let's put the ladders right here for now. There, I got the easy way up and the easy way down. And I don't have to worry about stuff spawning on the blocks. <laughs> Which, was, that was weird. That was so weird. I didn't think that side was in the, uh, I, in the chunk that has the deep ocean biome. Probably don't need as many slime blocks on me now, so we'll put those back. We'll put the random sticks back. And let's oh no no no. Let's see if we can get our uh, iron fellows to do a little pre-day trading.
No. No? Come on. Come on. Do I need to go grab some coal to unlock the iron trades again? Are you guys a little plugged? You, you don't take any fibrous trades. I mean, at least I got a fair bit of coal to work with. Let's try this again. Grindy project is grindy. I deeply apologize for that. Hi! I am going to go trade all this coal with you guys just because you made me go get it. Alright, so we're going to go a stack with Thrain. A stack with Thor. A stack with Thorin. trade enough to make that worthwhile. Alright, back to work. Alright. I wonder if that guardian farm is going to be tall enough to reach the uh, the island by then. I, think I, I guess I should look for there farms are. I mean, if only I had a couple of examples of working guardian farms. So I'll get the last weird amount that is not going to be what I'm looking for, but that's what you're offering, so that's what I'll take. lousy four glass that I can't <laughs> okay fine fine alright that gets me a little bit further now actually 
actually. I wonder if that's enough to get me up to up to 60. That might be enough. I mean, it's not like the extra cyan glass is going to go to waste because I'm going to need at least two layers of cyan glass for up on that river project. And given how much blue glass I've gone through with that, yikes. Yikes. Let me tell you, that was not... Not fun. Round and round we go. Yeah, uh, this should be enough glass to get me up to 60. And I'll put... Do I put the trapdoors at 60 or 61, do you think? I'm thinking 60, even though that might pull one spawnable block out of my uh, usable space. It would be kind of nice to have that handy just the same. How high is the top of how is the how high is the top of yours, Arcadius? Sixty-two. Okay. All right. So we'll have the spawnable space here at. 60. Oh, I'm out of glass. Okay. Oh, well. Uh, I'll get that squared away in a minute. I can at least work on this part while I wait. I just need some temporary blocks that are easily removed. With my luck, something's going to spawn behind me. Probably not until nighttime. My goal is to take that, and what I'll do is I'm going to get some trapdoors, and because there is a block under the trapdoor. The water should spread, and that way I don't have to individually waterlog each and every door. That is my hope. Uh, I'm definitely going to need one more round of glass trading. So I can get the border around this, and then... And then... And no one then. And then I'm going to need to... I'm going to need to complete a thought. Uh, no, I'm going to need to get the redstone hooked up. I'm going to set up the redstone on that side. I don't have a good way to do a pretty ledge without running into weird issues, sadly. Because I need just a smidge more space. 
Let's not fall off here, shall we? Alright, that's all the trapdoors, so I shouldn't have to worry about anything spawning up there while I sleep. Hey, accident! How you doing? I'm taking another stab at this guardian farm. Uh, hopefully. Yeah, that, that makes two of us. It's been... It's been a week. It's been one of those weeks where all you can do is nod and say, It's been a week. Although, coffee for the crafting. That helps. That helps a lot. <laughs> um, and you've already started your 1.18 world, right? I know we're not planning on starting until January 1st. Nice. How are you liking it so far? Are, are you finding the, uh, the caves deep enough and the cliffs high enough? <laughs> oh no, you, you have not seen the crazy begin until it, you watch Rayest try to figure out the storage for all the new blocks that have come. Good that the world gen is working out. Uh, I gotta admit, one of my concerns going into 1.18 was how it was going to handle some of that. Although, did you start a new world or upgrade an existing world? Because I, I do wonder if that makes a difference too. Or what difference that makes. Okay, so you started a new world. That's one of the reasons why we're kind of holding off until 1.18 actually rolled out. Uh, we are having to move the server from uh, Cube Toast to Nodecraft because Cube Toast is shutting down. And I'm kind of sad to see that go. They, they've been a wonderful host since we started with them. Huh. Exploring in per Oh, oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Come on, guys. I, I got, I got stuffs to do. Show me the emeralds. I'm trying to get a guardian farm put together. Uh, Skyblock, you don't necessarily need a temple area per se, but you do need prismarine over the water. Uh, I found out the hard way that there is still a height limit in place, so you you do um, you do need to make sure that you are at a certain minimum ele elevation. Really? I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, on the one hand, it, it's nice that it feels a little bit more uh, smooth. Is that the word I'm looking for? Maybe. Uh, on the other hand, it was always kind of nice to find some of the weird, the weird sheer, sheer cliffs and that sort of thing. Unless you were early enough in the game that you didn't have a easy way of getting around that. Uh, I I am deeply curious how how some of the farms are going to work now that you get a little bit more down below to clear out. Like if you're going to do an actual proper uh, slime farm, does this mean you're going to have to hollow out all the way down to like negative 120, 128? Yeah, that makes sense. That, that, that does make sense. That's a yes. Come on. No, 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 no. Give me the glass. Uh, <laughs> I, I am kind of... I am just a little sad that I, that we'll be wrapping this up and I won't have set done everything that I set out to do. Uh, that part is gonna kind of 
not me just a smidge. Oh, yeah. And I I want to say, was it you or somebody that you were replying to that was talking about uh, having some better ways to manage uh, removing water from an area would be kind of nice. Because right now, what are your options? You, you get a sponge or maybe you get a bunch of slime blocks. Yeah, I... And I want to say I've seen a couple other people mention that too, and especially now that we're getting more of the waterlogged caves, um, or underwater caves, waterlogged caves. <laughs> I mean, I guess, I guess after a fashion, that is, that is what it is, isn't it? But uh, yeah, so. Uh, if we're going to keep running into more underwater caves, it would be kind of nice to have a much easier way of overcoming overcoming that. And sponges help, but there's not enough ways to get sponges. And, and I, it was either you or somebody that you were commenting to on Twitter that mentioned, you know, maybe putting them in the coral reefs. You know, so you end up with some soak sponges and that generate as a part of the tropical ocean, which would be cool on a multitude of levels. Yes, there we go. Yeah, reefs with sponges would be great. Um, you know, get, getting the wandering trader to give you... Uh, yeah, yeah, waterlogged wool. That that wouldn't be bad. Especially given that, you know, wool farms aren't too hard to come by. And you can adjust the way you're doing it to the level of game you're willing to play, too. Because I, I know one of the concerns is that you don't want the power gamers to overpower it. If that makes sense. That, uh, that is a good question. All right, let's see if I can, how was the best way to do this? Just, now I got to clear out all these slime blocks. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. No. Because if I didn't have the slime blocks under the trapdoors, the water wouldn't have spread, and I'd been ferrying buckets up and down forever. Yeah. Well, even then, uh, I, some of the Cycraft solutions I've seen are, are some really crazy uh, sand contraptions. And don't think I hadn't thought about building a couple of them, too. Especially when you're trying to clear out a Guardian farm. Uh, I know they've got it set up so that way you just keep pushing out redstone. Or, pushing out redstone. You keep pushing out, <laughs> pushing out sand and the redstone just automatically pushes it forward so you get... Uh, you, you, you get things moving a little bit quicker. Yeah, I think I still enjoy this, uh, this way of, uh, yeah. This is still easier. Oh, potions of water breathing? Um, yeah, I guess the biggest problem is coming up with, uh... I was gonna say the biggest problem would be coming up with a brewing stand, but you can... F 
I don't know about Bedrock, though. Uh, I know in Java you can come across a village that has a brewing stand. Um, I can't remember if the brewing stands you find in the village have any... any f okay. I can't remember if the, the Java edition has fuel in theirs as well. It's one of the... It's one of those things that I never get around to actually looking for them until later anyway. So by the time I go looking for them, uh, I've already got the fuel to begin with. And again, that that's still only a short-term solution until you get to the nether. So either way, I guess, yeah, yeah. Uh, getting potions... Or, or do we, uh, do we make the poison potato the crafting ingredient for poisonous potions again and let pufferfish gig? <laughs> oh, yeah, I guess uh, one of the villagers, don't they have a bowl that gives you, uh, water breathing? Can't you get one of, one of those, one of those? feel like I'm misremembering stuff again. I mean, it's so rare. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the suspicious stews. For some reason, I thought that there was a uh, suspicious stew that gave you water breathing. Although, it, I guess the problem with the suspicious stews is the water breathing it gives you is like, for what, two seconds? Ten seconds? And since they don't stack a... a <laughs> You're rocking Minecraft back like it's version uh, 0 0.9. Back when uh, even the stakes didn't stack. I'm kind of glad I missed that one. I, I don't know that I would have. Uh, I don't know that I would have made it. Uh, this is not my best redstone. Fair warning. That this is my most expedient redstone. I really would have rather found a more elegant solution. You know, from a more civilized time. Arcadius didn't remind me that uh, the Book of Fett was coming out soon too. Yes, that was one of the data. That's one of the resource packs that I added server wide, uh, and that has been <laughs> that has been very helpful in troubleshooting, uh, especially when I was troubleshooting the the sheep farm mechanic there too. I mean. It's one of those things that we all felt pretty good about adding because you could technically get the power level from the F3 menu if you if that's what you really wanted to do. Um, but it, it is kind of nice to just have that right there. All right, let's do... this and that's gonna go there because the redstone block will eventually go there I'm also trying to be very conscious of the fact that I don't want stuff spawning on here while I'm at it all right, manual switch until I can get things properly done. So that should flood all that. And if this actually worked right. Oh, did I get some guardians? I got some cod. I think I heard a, <laughs> I think I heard a dolphin falling. Guardians? 
I got squid and dolphin. Are you kidding me with this? Where's my guardians? Or am I too far away now? How far away are you supposed to be for the guardians to spawn? Having another short-term memory moment. Well, my black ink problem is solved. Uh, oh. Okay, now the water level is going down. Is it? It should be. That was part of, that was one of the problems I was trying to fix. Or are they just staying on top of the Okay. Okay. Good. All right, one problem fixed. One problem still to go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that is one of the things I am trying to be uh, slightly mindful of. Um, ostensibly, as long as your water source is below prismarine, you're supposed, and you're in a deep ocean biome. Uh, uh, I can never remember where to find it. Uh, biome, Minecraft, deep ocean. Okay, so I am in a deep ocean biome. It is a water source. It is... It should be in the right height levels. Or or did I do I not have the right height yet? And I need to uh work on that part. I swear for a second there, I thought I heard her drown. <sighs> Bother. Nope, now I got my squid and dolphins. Alright. Let me go put stuff away so I can at least clear out my inventory. I, I got... I don't need... I need to cover that. Okay. Uh, I'll I'll be over here mumbling mumbling to myself. As long as I don't start going on about my precious, uh, I think we should be okay. Maybe. <laughs> Hello. Wait a second. Hey. There's a wandering trader, and he's right here. Limited time offers. All right. You, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, you're going to miss the ta-da when he drinks his potion. Where were Hello? Oh. oh. Okay. Um. You'll be happy with I got... Blue dye, I got beetroot, I got purple dye, I got... Oh, you bum. You still... No bamboo. No ice. No sand. None of the stuff I could really use. I mean... Alright, I, I could use the puzzle. I really could. But... Uh, 
I I thought bamboo was one of the ones that he was supposed to have. Or is this just one of those in, in the more abstract? Hello? No, stop, stop. Wait. No. Hey. No. Wait. No. Stop. Wait. Hey. Hey. Wait. Stop. Yeah, yeah. Come on, man. No. I know you don't have potions of fire resistance. Hey, I was looking for some new more llamas. And look at that, llamas appeared. Huh. Funny that. Oh, come on, where's the other lead? No? Are you kidding me? I mean, I guess technically as long as I lead only one of you, the others should follow, right? There we go. Alright, you're not going anywhere just yet. Let me go, let me go. I need... I need to not block myself in. <laughs> I need to get those guys over in there, too. Uh... Is that gonna is that gonna increase my animal count? All right, I need two orange carpet. No, nope, I'm not gonna waste the sugar on you guys. Of course, I don't think it's sugar anyway. I think it's wheat, and I'm still not gonna waste the wheat on you guys. Let's let's just you know. Hi, friend. Come on. Let's see the hearts. Huh? Huh? Come on. What's really going to be a pain is trying to get these guys up there. Come on, man. Why, why are you being stubborn? The mule is over there. I already got a meal. Oh, I need to go grab a couple of uh, chests, too. The whole point of having you guys is so I got something to, to move things. Extended inventory. <laughs> that's what I need to... That's what I need to do. I need to get a couple of name tags and name all these... Llamas extended inventory. Or do I just call you thing one and thing two? Of course that that's getting back into the Dr. Seuss from earlier. Come on. You you seriously gonna be that stubborn? Alright, what about you? Huh? Oh, you don't have a whole lot of hearts there, good sir. Come on. What? What? Arr, fine. Fine. I'll deal with you two later. Sorry. I'll deal with you guys later. That's fine. That's fine. Be obstinate. See how well that works out for you. All right, let's put that away. Let's put that away. I shouldn't need any more cobble while I ponder things. I should be good. No, I'm going to need a couple of those. Um, let's get... The ladder's put away. Let's get our black dye put away. Our fish.
I guess I really do need to empty a few of those too. Uh, I'll hang on to the rest of that for the moment. I don't think I need them. But I'd rather have them and not need them than the other way around. I definitely don't need that water bucket. No, there's no rhyme or reason to any placement in there at all. Uh, so. Now that we've moved stuff around, let's see if any guardians have spawned in here. No. Nope. I've got cod squid. Cod and squid. Is it the elevation again? I'd go visit Arcadius' island to see where his was set up. Except, uh, somebody doesn't have a way for visitors to get down there. I don't know. Medic, is your, uh,. Is your guardian farm operational at that elevation? And if so, do you know what elevation it is at? Ooh, I just realized I might want to put a clock up here and get it set up to, uh, to cycle the water in and out. Like, fill it with water just long enough to spawn the guardians and then drop it so that way they drop quicker. Or maybe that's just if I keep running into more of those guys. I mean, could it be could it be just because I have the the trap doors underneath? Because it's not water and then Hmm. Well, if I ever needed cod, I got that problem solved. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, I know. I've got some prismarine up there. I, I don't have more than the little bit of prismarine that's there, though. Or are you saying uh, it's just the prismarine? And nothing else. Do you have a ladder over here? Do I, do I just, or maybe I just need to keep doing the, um, whatchamacallit challenge until I get enough. So if there's anything between the block and the prismarine, they won't spawn. Because that kind of sucks then there's no way to turn farms on and off. Uh, oh. Hello. You are not what I was looking for. Just want the top of your prismarine farm. I, I didn't go far enough up. That is the top. Alright, so you've got your prismarine at 64. Alright, looking at 64. Mine is at 60. I can't imagine that makes that big a difference. Those four blocks. Uh, where is the bottom of yours? Uh, Minecraft signs at 48. I've got mine going all the way down to 40. Alright, 
let me go let me go axe the uh doggone it. I was really looking for a way to turn this thing on and off again. That's why I tried the dispensers, but the dispensers weren't um Actually come to think of it. Why don't you have guardians dropping out of yours? Because you get Prismarine over water. Or can I not start your farm? Oh, biome change. Okay. Alright. No, that's fine. Uh, I get it. Is that really going to be my only option for turning the farm on and off is switching biomes? Eh, I wouldn't call it a great on-off switch, but uh, it seems like the only one we're likely to get. Well, I guess that simplifies the, uh, the redstone, doesn't it? I should have brought some shears with me. Alright, all that hard work to find out that I'm not going to be able to do a proper redstone switch for this. Because of course not. Fine. Fine. I'll do it your way, Minecraft. I'll build a flying machine that flies, that pushes the, uh... Oh, wait a second. What if I... I wonder, I wonder what I need to do to do a piston feed tape that would push the prismarine over and then push cobblestone back. I'll have to think about that one. In the meantime, since I need more prismarine, I'll uh, go knock out the no, that wasn't exactly what I wanted to do, but here I am. get a uh, get a uh, some sort of piston feed tape or something that runs that changes the roof over the top I will have a redstone on off switch on this <laughs> I mean I just got to get it to move it over six spaces all right, let's put that up there for now to keep stuff from spawning on top. And, uh... Oh, and there they go. Which now makes me wonder if the problem with the shorter version of this wasn't the height so much as I had something between the prismarine and the water. I'm not tearing this down and shortening it up. Unless I desperately need the cyan glass. 
No. I'm not tearing this down and shortening it up. Alright. Yeah, the trapdoors. I'm going to have to tear those out. Uh, I'll tear them out as I replace the cobblestone. Um, and I, yeah, I can put the trapdoors on top to spawn proof it. Uh, but again... I guess I'm I guess I am gonna be learning about uh flying machines. Oh, let me pick up the wool. I wouldn't want to waste that. I have such a shortage. I don't think anybody bought that one. Cause I tried oh, I lost two trapdoors somewhere. That's a shame. Um, because again, just like with all my other farms, I'm really trying to set this up with some sort of on off. So that way, once this fills up, it will automatically turn the farm off. Um, or if I just don't want to run the guardian farm, it'll turn it off. And since I can't do the trap doors, that, that does leave me thinking that maybe maybe I will end up having to having to um, build a flying machine. Oh for shame. I'm gonna have to learn to build a flying machine. Huh. That that's gonna be that's gonna be horrible for me. Five. All right, so there's my eleven. I mean, I guess at the end of the day, I'm not too worried about trapdoors and cobblestone. At this point, I'm more interested in sea lanterns and challenge completion. All right, so this 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 part should actually go pretty quick. As I expand this out, we'll get more guardian spawns, although probably not while I'm standing over the spawning spot. Which will in turn get me more shards. Funny feeling that's going to fill up a lot more than I realize. All right, let's get. Is that going to be enough? That should be enough. Gonna need more than 40, but th this will definitely speed things up a little bit more. I wonder what I can do to get the rates up a little bit faster, though. That's that's not enough guardians. I need more guardians. Actually, let, let, me, let, let me let me let me let me finish filling this out first before I start saying I need more guardians. That that. This way lies madness. I, I'm still, I just, I don't, I don't know. So, some of the changes just, I, I don't, I don't get them.
fine. Uh. I will uh, I will eventually replace that redstone dust for spawn proofing. I might I might put uh, I might put some slabs up once I figure out how how to move the roof back and forth because I, I if this is going to be deep ocean I am going to need well I could use lights lanterns would work if as long as I had the lanterns above enough lanterns above where the where the the flying machine would go forgot the teep doors oh oh under that one yeah. I've been forgetting a lot of stuff lately. I'd sing the lyrics to What's My Name Again if I could remember that too. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh man. Is that the most 90s reference I could make? I don't think that is the most 90s reference that I could make, but it's probably pretty close. Is that Blink-182? No. Who was that? It was one of those almost pop bands. So I need six, twelve, twenty four more. I would take it as a kindness of those trapdoors that fall now, too. All right, maybe I don't need more. Maybe, maybe the farm is big enough. need 24 of the prismarine. Yep, I definitely need to work on a proper on-off switch and maybe I need to go um respec re <laughs> re one of the villagers if you catch my drift to be a fisherman so I got somebody to sell all that cod to. Actually, I wouldn't mind more guardian. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll, I'll wait until I'll wait until season three to build an even more ridiculous guardian farm. Because the one I did last season wasn't ridiculous enough. I need to make one more ridiculous than I did last go around. It was beautifully decorated, but uh, I, I definitely I. So I've gone from helping Arcadius with a simple one in season one to building a moderately complex one in Season 2. No, sorry, helping Arcadius in Season 0. Moderately complex in Season 1. 
uh, going simpler but more productive here in Season 2. And I definitely want to make Season 3 the season that I make a Guardian Farm that is absolutely insane. And insanely useful. Mostly just insane. And I did forgot the trapdoors again. No, I'm not gonna no. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try for a cobble. <laughs> for one cobblestone block. I mean, I guess I could just carpet it with, uh, I got enough cyan wool to carpet it. But not if I'm gonna, I'm gonna get things moving. All right. This is beautiful. I need to break, make a proper observational platform. Ooh, I gotta double check and make sure when this thing empties, it picks up those guys too. It, it is emptying, right? Uh-oh. It is not picking up stuff on top of the slab. Huh. Oh. Let's try with less falling this time. Or did it pick them up? Did I miss it? <laughs> that's that's a modest amount of drops. I deeply, deeply want to make this more ridiculous. You have no idea how much I want to make this even more ridiculous. I'm missing some trapdoors. Sea lanterns! Uh, yeah, I gotta, I gotta find something to do about the cod. That's, that's just not, that's just not acceptable. I need to start putting some placeholders in for a bunch of this stuff anyway, so we'll let that run for the moment. No. No. No hoppers. Make it out of dirt if you want. No hoppers. Um, as the admin who has to worry about lag. No. Please. Please. I beg of you. No hoppers. <laughs> Do, do, do your admin a kindness. <laughs> no, no hoopers, no hoopers. All right. <laughs> All right. 
Uh, we'll put that in there for now. I finally need a trash bin, like an actual proper trash bin. And I might even put it over by the Guardian farm too for all the good God. Isn't there a challenge for Cod? Uh... Yeah, I, you know what? I think I'm just going to have to move the Prismarine over to one of those sides there. Put the sea lan no, I'll put the sea lanterns in there. That's close enough to blue. Sure. Yep. You get your, your bitcha. We'll move those over there. Nobody needs more than two rows of uh, soul lanterns. Don't tell Riest I said that. There's my torches. And the last three will be sea lanterns. Because I'm going to want a lot of those. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's not going to work out as planned. Nope. I'm going to need more. Uh, let's get... things you can make out of actual prismarine. Alright, so we'll have the prismarine and we'll have... Wait, how do I have the other set up? Slab stairs walls. So we'll go walls. Because I don't see myself needing more than that. some more so I can start making all the other stuff. Wow. <laughs> yeah, well we got everybody in chat. I know I know Medic's work schedule has had him uh Yeah. Tied up. And here I was thinking this might not be a big enough uh, guardian farm. I still got to work on an actual proper on-off switch. Uh, I may, <laughs> I may need to set up uh, two carts, two tracks, because that's that's a lot more uh, that's a lot more than I'm worried about. I'm still kind of mad that that's not getting picked up. Uh, I should have moved this out one more block. So that way I didn't have to worry about that um, up incline. Because, uh, <laughs> yeah, one hopper is not picking this up. Not even a little bit. We are outpacing all the hoppers. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay though. All right, let's do that. <laughs> uh <laughs> Yeah, I will probably keep a full double chest of shards. This is going to be more of the same, right? Oh wait, no. There's no prismarine brick walls. 
Mo Yang, why no prismarine brick walls? Now, if we're if we're getting back to things that are missing that they really, really, really need to work on, how about parity? So that way all the blocks that have slabs and stairs but are missing walls, you know, that kind of thing. That would be kind of nice. Oh, are you kidding me? That would be very, very nice. I need to find... I need to get some boots of Frostwalker and just go running around, <laughs> running around in there collecting stuff. <laughs> Oh, yes, yes. Let, let's not even get in on the concrete concrete slabs and stairs. Uh, that's a beautiful sight. And I guess I technically don't need that slab there. I, I was worried about these guys surviving the fall. And... Uh, and not dying when they landed, and those getting stuck blocking up the rail, but it looks like that's not really a problem. So, let's just go ahead and knock that out. That'll, that'll save that. Eventually, I need to get some boots of Frostwalker for that. So that hurts less. <laughs> I don't, like, what? Wool armor? Armor? I mean, what, what's the wool, the wool armor going to let you do that you can't do already? Uh, is it going to get, like, I hate to say it, but one of the nice things about the, the latest update is at least it gives leather boots something useful. You, you don't sink into the powdered snow. It'd be kind of nice if leather armor became more useful than that thing that you use for the few seconds that you're still stuck on, uh, I haven't found iron yet. Make a red hoodie. Uh, somebody has a hoodie because because they they had a custom skin made for him. Yeah, and, and honestly, I'm not mad about that either. I uh, I do. I do like the change in the dynamic that being, you know, gold armor actually has a purpose now, uh, which is something that was, which is something that was missing. Uh, I, I'd still like gold tools to have a better use. I need to get a proper, uh, proper trash bin I might even set it up so that way it, it ties into this stuff right here because uh, those hoppers are almost always full with carpet anyway all right <laughs> isn't that a beautiful sight well, I mean, as long as they're on that side of the glass. <laughs> oh. Yep. Now I gotta figure out how to... I gotta figure out how to set that up so that way I can remove the... Prismarine from the roof and sub in 
uh, cobblestone or something, and then back and and then go the other way around. So that way I don't have to keep swapping biomes every time I want this to change. And I can get it set up so that way once this is full, it'll uh, it'll do its thing and shut it off. Or do I have enough room for hoppers to build another layer over here and just get another container like this with its own separate track? Although this is having enough trouble keeping up with a six wide band of spawnage. I'd, if it wasn't so much work to do it, I'd almost want to cut it in half and do like three wide a space, three wide, a space, and then maybe get them both to dump into a common storage. Yeah, I'm not tearing that down. Nope. Not this time. Nope, nope, nope. Not this time. Ooh. Before I forget, doesn't, doesn't one of my... Doesn't one of my villagers have Frostwalker? So uh, yes! Yes! You have Frostwalker! How much is Frostwalker to? 38 ammo. Ah. Fine, fine, fine. Let me, uh, let me get... <laughs> wonder if I should call them Boots of Rayest Feet since they're, you know, Frost. Do I need to give you guys a moment to uh, work at your station? I need one more round. Chili penguin boots. Cause honestly, I don't I don't need I don't need all the enchantments on them. I just need the frost walker so that way I can run around in there and just pick up stuff out of the inventory. Or pick up stuff a little bit quicker. That's not going to get tired. That, that's not going to get old for a while. Look at that. I also notice I suddenly don't have the, the squid and... Um, no, more, no more squid. No more squid and dolphins. I wonder if that's one of those things that once I swap, get the roof to swap out, I'll, oh, 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 that's going to suck. Because uh, I was just thinking about that. Uh, if, if I do have the roof switch over. I'm still going to have dolphin and squid spawning in there instead of guardians. Which negates the point of having something to shut off storage. Alright, I'm going to have to think on that one for a little bit. Because that, that's going to be a bit of a puzzle. I, I deeply want on off. Um, Alright, that should be enough emeralds. Do I have any? Yes, I have books. Okay. I don't know why I was worried about that. All right, Mr. Frostwalker. Yes. 
and that still leaves me a few extra emeralds just in case another wandering trader comes by, which would be kind of nice. We get some chill boots. <laughs> yeah, but even even in a regular regular vanilla guardian farm, that should still be producing some uh, squid and such. All right, have fun. I'm probably going to be calling it a wrap here soon, too, because the tired is real. I have got to get my guitar workbench squared away, so that way I can get a kit built that I was supposed to do. Um, all right. I may have to put a door there. Uh, there. There's a kit build that I was supposed to do in June. Uh, that, that I deeply want to work on. Do I even want to take a whole spot for those? Yeah, I will. Alright, let's, uh... Hello, sea lanterns. Alright. Now I just wish I had a way to, to kill them quietly. something other than the falling death. I don't know. I, I don't think there's a way to do that in this game. Not yet. Not now. Uh, where did I put the stuff? Here. Do I want to go ahead and craft this stuff up to bricks or do I just want to start filling up my reserve of shards and such? Yeah. Let's, um... Uh, get our prism crystals, our shards. I need to come back through with the book and lock those in place so I don't keep uh, moving them around. Stuff and things. All right. Yeah, I'll go back through with the with that later. Yeah, I could mute, but that that's also a little awkward in the middle of the game, or in the middle of a stream rather. Oh, the bounty. I still want to make it bigger. Am I wrong for that? I wish I had. I, I wish I could do more hoppers, because then I'd have a row of two. Yeah, I could have a row of two, or or one cart per every two two rows, and get that going. Oh, for just one more hopper, I could get a line going here and get those three. Leave that cart for those three. It could happen. All right. I might make that work. Or do I have this one going into this chest and this one going into a second chest? All right, Medic, have fun. I'll see you next time while I ponder deep thoughts about <laughs> about how to rework this to uh, make the collection just a smidge more efficient. Uh, hmm. <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. I'm happy that, that there's other people that get that one. 
How much sand did I get by... Because I, I cleared that out at the beginning of the stream. How many how many more bricks worth of sand do I have? Am I going to make... Am I... Ooh, am I going to... Mm. All right, maybe not. <laughs> Yay! Two blocks. All right. Maybe once I get that doubled up, I'll uh, I'll have enough. I'll have enough sand to actually uh, finish the pyramid challenge. Cause I'm so close. I, I just need eight stacks of uh, sandstone, and then I'll have it. Um, what is there a challenge I can do real quick before I call it a night? Cod salmon. Oh, yeah. I, mm, I don't have a Nautilus shell. Huh. Where am I going to get a Nautilus shell? I mean, at least the reward is going to give me back a shell. But that doesn't seem right. Is there one that I haven't finished that gives me a, a Nautilus shell? And I gotta get cranking on that Nether Fortress too. Cause I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a lot of bricks. Since I've already got a fair number of bricks in that farm there, I might uh I might just re rebuild the frame around it. <laughs> uh, the requirements for that one. All right, I guess I'm not finishing one tonight. All right. I hope you had fun. I am going to take a look and see who's live. All right. Thank you all for joining along. I hope you had fun Tuesdays, 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern and Fridays, 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern, or at least 6.30 is the aspirational time. My uh, ability to estimate how long it will take to finish that one last repair has been off. We'll call it off. Uh, hopefully next time uh, we'll, we'll manage that one better. All right. I am going to raid Beast Lord J. It looks like he's playing something called Griftlands. Not sure about what that is, so let's uh let's go check it out. If you haven't already, give him a follow. He is good peoples. And I will stick around for the raid, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>